about drifting is the culture. Everywhere you go, everyone's willing to help out, everyone's friends, and you're all just there to shred and drive your car. Our slogan is dream, design, build, and everything about this car plays completely into that. It's just such with the dream. You design it, it's all the works, and then you build it. My name is Rob Parsons. I'm the founder and president of the Chersler Foundation and the owner of Chersler Racing. The accident happened on June 5th, 2011 with a dirt bike accident back in Canada. I hit a crappy line on a jump and uh, just landed stiff-legged and broke every bone in my body. It was a very bad accident. Or once I got out of the hospital, I was able to pretty much start my rehabilitation. And I focused that in my shop and I started working. That's how I started living my life again. The first thought of the clutch system came to me while I was in the hospital. And uh, it just came from the inability to find what I actually needed. There's nothing out there like what I've made and I needed something that would be as fast or faster than the human foot. And what we have now is a system that disengages it 95 milliseconds. This is the clutch right here. When I pull it, that disengages the clutch. And this upshift, downshift, this is down for gas. That's push for brake. And when I pull the handbrake, the clutch automatically disengages. Yeah, that's all you do for drifting. <laughs> With SolidWorks, I was able to visualize absolutely everything before I even made it. The roll cage is built to strengthen the chassis as well as um, for safety and rollovers and side impacts. Biggest issue with building these types of roll cases and chassis modifications is getting in and out. Typically you would get in, measure it, get out, fit a piece. Now what we would do to build a roll cage is we will go into the vehicle, 3D scan the inside of the chassis, and then import that uh, file into SolidWorks. Then we build the roll cage around that 3D model that we scan. Everything in the software just helps save time and you can create a whole product that you can pretty much see if it'll work before you even make it. As I was building the car, I noticed that there was just an ample amount of people that were interested in the design, the hand controls, and all that stuff. And so I started the foundation because other guys wanted to drive my car or that wanted to buy the hand control system. And I just thought that we might as well give them the opportunity to learn how to drive this specific car. So we bring guys out, we get them on the track, and we teach them how to drive. People get so down on themselves because they don't think they can do something, and just getting inside the vehicle and driving it, it completely changed their lives. I'm definitely driving this car better than I used to before my accident because of the way that the car was designed and the visualization through SolidWorks. It's insane to see how much better I've been able to drive this car with my hands instead of my legs.